Hello, this is Brad Weil, and I want to give you a quick overview of explaintools.com. There are three parts, starting at the bottom, a descent calculator, then there's a company route generator for JAR aircraft, but probably the most important area of Explain Tools is the flight plan conversion. And I think we're going to spend our time there. So what this does is it allows you to take flight plans that you get in various places on the web. I've picked the three most popular and then convert them into the X-Plane default FMS format. So let's start with Flight Aware. I've gone ahead and found a flight between Cleveland and Chicago. And if you drop down to flight data, you'll see the flight plan here with the SID and stars. But what you want is the decoded version. You want all the waypoints and the coordinates. So you select all of that. And you copy it to the clipboard. Put in a name for your file. And this is what you'll pull up once you're in the airplane and x-plane and you paste in what you just copied select the source what you want the output to be and then you can go ahead and convert it and this is what it looks like and then you can just use the right click or some way to save that file down to the output folder and explain. Let's try one here from Sky Vector. Same flight plan, but I want all of the waypoints, so I use the, the nav log. I select all of those just like I did. You have to be careful because you don't want any of this. So I cut it to my clipboard, put in your file name, paste in your waypoints, and then you can select your source and then what kind of output you want. And again, you get that format that you need for X-Plane. That is Root Finder. I'm not real wild about Root Finder because I think that the flight plans it generates are completely whacked, but <laughs> that's just my opinion. I think it's much better for the European folks. So I'm going to go ahead and select that. Cut it into Explain Tools. My output and go ahead and convert that. And again, you have that default file. One other feature of this, it does generate a couple of other outputs. So let me go back and put in one from Sky Vector. It will create the world traffic text file, which looks like this. So I think that covers the flight plan converter. Then just take a quick look at the descent calculator. Again, you just put in your cruise altitude. So it's probably better for general aviation aircraft. Uh, dropping down to 3,000 feet, let's say, and your speed above, let's say it's uh, 250 speed below 150 and you're going to descend at 1500 feet so you need to begin your descent 39.44 uh, miles out from your destination and it will also give you your vertical speed based on your distance and this simply puts in the the direct And you can see it just drops in the direct between these two waypoints. Again, not a big deal, but it's necessary for the company route on JAR aircraft. So that's a quick overview of Explain Tools.